tutorials. In the part one, we have shown you how you can model in this eyeball, and in this part is going to be about UVing. Now I'm using Maya 2018, and it is a bit different with the UVing. I can just select the UV editor just right there, and it is not like the way we need to see it. But if you're using the more older version of Maya, you can just go to the modeling tab and you can find some of tool here. And of course you can just go to Windows, modeling and UV editor. So this is going to be kind of the same thing. So mostly they are kind of the same. So, so I'm going to show this for this one. As you can see, we have a UV, it is good, it is not bad, but the problem is we want to shade in this with the Maya texture shading. So we want to add the noise and we want to use the ramp texture to it. So we need to UV it correctly. So you can just go to UV here and create a plane, but you can find it also here. And you can also find it in the new, new UV tool kit in the crate and there. But if you want to have open the option box, I think this one is better. Resetting the tool, I think the Z is going to be correct one. So now I have making the cutting it like the way I want to be. And the second thing we want to control a space, I can just move, make it bigger and smaller. The thing I want to cut this one from is this one. So double click on it, control the space back to the UV editor. And I think we have a cut here. Mm, I think it was this one which it is so now I need to select the shell UV shell select this scale it down we don't need to have a texture for the white one and the important thing do not move this up or down it should be in the central of the UV if you do this so shading you're getting shading properly with the mapping but now I want to scale it a bit more to get more uh, uh, detail on the texture. So here you can see everything is good, but this one is reddish. If you want to just fix it very quickly, you can go down to unfold and optimal. And you can scale it down so like so, and that it is. So every of the UV is now good. So the same thing for the other. So we're just using this one as the example. And in the next video, we're going to show you how you can uh, shading it.